Warning, this video may contain content that may not be suitable for children or anyone else that is easily offended. Strong language, graphic content, nudity, bad jokes, and a possible idiot, aka myself, may be featured in the following clip. Newer discretion is advised. You're not responsible for any damages that you receive watching this video. <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's Zams, and welcome back to Guilt Part 5. Where we last left off, we ran into our cousin Emily, and she said, Don't act like you don't remember what you did to me. Sally was like, Huh? We're not too sure what Sally did, and Sally seemed like she don't know what she did either, but she did say that her friends made fun of her, but they were just kidding. But at the same time, you know, it's hurting Emily's feelings. You should have spoke up. You should have said something. So that goes to show you that bullying does exist if you are being bullied be aware this game does hold some sensitive topics so if it does infect you or impact somebody that you know be sure you reach out and seek help but for now let's get it get out of my face we are outside so we're supposed to be going to the gym but we're pretty sure the gym is already locked but i think we came from the main building right and we came to the auditory so we came from the main building and then we went over to the auditorium, then we came out of the art center, and now we're going up into the gym. Uh, so let's see how that works out for us. I need to move my, uh, Ow! Uh, move my microphone over a little bit. All right, let's go up in here. Maybe they're okay. helping us currently, and we don't know. Emily's yet. waiting for me on the roof. The roof, the roof, the roof is on fire. We don't know nice. what. It's locked from the other side. So we're gonna have to do the rev, the duty tutti, the wombo combo, and set it to wombo and go upstairs and try to find a way around like we always do. Uh oh, wait a minute, what's going on now? Oh yeah, don't forget to hit that like button if you are enjoying this gameplay. If you have any more game recommendations, feel Jim free to let us know. Jim is all twisted too. Uh, I'm gonna check I should out be some, used to this by now. I'm gonna check out some more uh, Google Stadia games to see if you like those. Sports prison. So this is the basketball court. We're still on the second floor. Uh, the creatures is in that room. I bet I can use that tower over there to get to the roof. Now. <laughs> what is that? All right, that door is open. Let me just look around a bit before we go anywhere. It's called the isolation cell. Uh, it must be where uh, Emily felt like she was isolated from the rest of the group. I can't reach the ladder from here. Maybe from the basement. It's following me. <laughs> so. Alright, let's check this room first. What is this? This doesn't have a name for it. Let's look around, see if we can find any clues. Finders keepers. Let me top off my health. <gasps> this inhaler. We are good. Wuss, it says, wussies go home. Wow. Damn, son. I don't even know if you can say that. Oh, it's a rock people. Oh, what is this? Another strange uh, book. It itches. Let's see. It's over now. Alright, so we helped another person. That's another ticket piece. It looks like an old piece of cable car ticket, but it's old and worn. I may be crumbled to dust at any moment. Maybe if we save all the people correctly, then we can um, access the cable car sometime later on. Where was it? Is it this one? Copper, yep. Yeah. It is just so much. I keep scratching like it's crazy. Uh, like crazy. The nurse told me not to, but she doesn't know how to bat it. I need it. Ugh. That's one thing I'm glad it's gone. Those dumb, good-for-nothing nurses. Uh, I can see how they looked at me, that expression of disdain. Uh, they thought I was disgusting. Well, yeah, my skin is disgusting. I know. Burning red and falling to pieces. It's not a pretty postcard. It's not a pretty postcard. And it itches so much. Ah, where are the damn painkillers? It gets worse and worse when it started bleeding. I left the room screaming at those lazy nurses, but they weren't there. Uh, but they weren't there, and they weren't anywhere. I roamed through the, uh, I roamed through the uh, corridors looking for some drugs to help me ease the pain, but the whole place was freaking deserted. If I knew back then what was lurking on these dark rooms, I wouldn't have been that loud. I guess that it hurt me screaming that monstrous thing 
It jumped out of nowhere, hauling like a maniac, trying to rip my head off. I don't know what the hell it was, or that was, but it didn't look human. The skin was like mine, red, cracked, disgusting, but the face upside down. Huge mouth and sharp teeth, nightmarish. Yeah, I ran into those. I would have died right there in the spot if it wasn't for Cooper, uh, my Labrador. I don't know how uh, how he found me, but he appeared at the last second, distracted him so I could escape. Now I'm here trapped in his room, copper on my lap, trying to stay quiet as quiet as possible, but it itches so bad. I have to scratch it quietly. My skin, it was like the monsters. Am I going to turn into that? I thought uh, why they left us here in the hospital. Uh, I thought I had a psoriasis. I know that one. Psoriasis, but uh, maybe it's something else entirely. Something much, much worse. I can't believe I'm going to die in this stupid hospital. At least Cooper is with me. He's a good dog. He doesn't think I'm disgusting, right, Cooper? I don't know what's going on with this, uh, with his eyes. Uh, they look bright and green, but there's no doubt it's my old Koopy. Uh, he died when I was seven, but he comes back for me. Oh my gosh, she had a like a, a angel protector dog or something going on. All right, well that person had something on the skin. Maybe the skin was them turning. Maybe the skin was them turning into. The skin was them turning into that little crystal monster that we use to help people. Something over there. I don't want to go there yet. We gotta check everything. puzzle thing. Um, let me see if there's anything on lockers. No? Alright, let's uh, let's get it. Get you. Uh, oops. Get you. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I got a certain amount of time. Alright, uh, 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 There it is. Got it. It didn't take me that long. Wasn't such a good idea. Oh my god, I told you she was my twin. I just said the same thing. We shouldn't have done that yet. Oh man. Alright, hold on, let's grab some batteries. Grab myself getting juicy already, though. Another novel or another book that's way left behind that we can read? Yep, it is. It's another strange book. It says, I'm so scared. Gym class. Ooh, one of the worst classes of uh, high school. Yeah, I'm trying to be nicer and smile more. I try to hide from everyone, but it doesn't matter. I still feel like I'm being watched. When some kids laugh at me or take anything or take my things or hurt me, there's always more kids watching. They see what happens and they do nothing. No one helps me. No one calls the teachers. They just stare. I know the mean kids hurt me because they don't like me, but if everyone else watches and does nothing, does that mean they hate me too? And that just goes back to what I was saying earlier. If you're sitting there and you're watching it happen, then you're part of the problem. And I think that's what Sally did. So she thought Sally hated her too, probably because Sally did nothing to protect this girl. Nothing at all. This game is funny though, it's creaking wood. Like ain't nobody turned around and did nothing or said anything or nothing. I have to go into this isolation cell. Get this key real quick. I don't know if there's a monster in here from earlier. Or it was one of those. Now we're good. Turn this flashlight on. I'm trying to look at the camera to see if it's dark or not. But top off our head. Grab this. Grab it, girl. Wait. There it is. I might need this. I just found out today that I can get a 
to mechanical key suppressors. A uh, lock key number two, a small key label with the number two is one of the three keys needed to unlock the gym's basement. I didn't know we need the key to unlock the gym's basement. Well, that's one. I want to buy a mechanical key, mechanical key suppressors from uh, Amazon. So my, I don't hear the clicking as much when I uh, hit down on the ground. Some people like it, some people don't, but I just feel like it's better. So you don't, because you can hear me while I'm talking over the editing and over the, um, the gameplay down here. So. Steam just must be frozen. Yeah, we got that. There we are. That fire extinguisher is more uh, handy than the uh, flashlight, in my opinion. Because the, the thing freezes the monsters and it gives you time to run. But at the same time, if you have more pressure, you can push it. Ah, so we gotta cut this one off to give it more. Gosh, look at this. Looks like one of those underground like cartel tunnels. Uh oh. Even in the locker room. Look at this, man. That's not okay. This when you step in the middle, like oh you can't go. But you step in the middle, like the next person, that toucher, is getting beat down. I know violence is not the answer. I know. But sometimes, you know, sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, what's, 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 this is the coach room. So let's see what's inside the coach's room and then see what we can do. But as of right now, we, have to, we can freeze this. Move this TV. I don't know where this goes, but we'll have to move it off the way. I think we can get to that eyeball right there. Freeze it one more time. from the earlier rooms, right? Uh, yep, that's from the, to get back to where we were on. Okay, so there's nothing in here. And then, be good. And we can just go back down to this, uh, try looking for the second key for the basement. Thank gosh they haven't ran out of, uh, it hasn't ran out of any, um, fire stairs. So like there's nothing that you have to pick up to keep using it. Cause usually, a weapon that good, it'll be like, hey man, could you like go find some more stuff like you do with the batteries and the uh, health? Like you have to find some of these. I don't know what the fuck it is. Is that carbon and oxygen? Is it carbon? Carbon, whatever is it? Oh, carbon and oxygen. You know what I mean. Danger mining and mine gases. Alright, so fire extinguisher is going to come in handy. Another one. Oh, so, that must mean something. I don't know what that means. I hope not, man. There's a the key. <laughs> what is that? Small key, level number one. It's one of the three keys needed to unlock the turn. Alright, let's go back up. Go check the top floor. You haven't been up there yet, so maybe there's something I might need. Let me take a can of soda. Just in case that crispy sprite from McDonald's. So I can burn somebody's throat off if they try something. Hmm. So let's see. I'll take this. Yeah, sounds like that thing that we don't like just came from somewhere. Excuse me. Sorry, sir. 
you have to go. Is there another one? Yes, yeah, an event. Oh man. Okay. There's one right here too. Give me that. Oh, it's a ladder right here. I'm an idiot. And then we go down. Okay, we move this thing of boxes right here in the middle. Okay, so right about here. Yep, right about here. Track on this game is pretty lit, but it makes you feel like you're being chased or watched or something. Uh oh, I think this might be the last boss fight or something. Make sure there's no holes or crevices, anything I can get to. Maybe up there. No. All right, let's get it. This is the office. It doesn't say which office, but it's a office. Looks like the security room. Good on that. Found the last key. Small key, blah, blah, blah. lock room number three is gonna go up. Let you know how much I might need this. Yeah, we killed like three monsters in there. Yep, yeah, the fire monster is here somewhere. You can tell. Yeah. Sweet. Oh no. Oh. Ouch. That was. You get Ouch. It? Must be warned. Where's my helmet? Are they gonna give me a helmet or not, fam? Alright, where is he at? Let me at him! My scrappy dude. Puppy power! Uh oh, here he comes. He's just sitting up there, look! He wanna read me. There's no other way. I have to do this.
If I did, Emmy's waiting on the roof. I have to get up there as soon as possible. So let's see. Um, the dude is down. Is there anyone I can see him? Where do you fall at? Yeah, he's right here. Oh my god. Bro, you better. Bro. Oh! Yes, right. Boy, I want nut. Thumbnail. Oh my gosh. This is the fastest she can climb. Hold on, Emily. I'm coming. Well, then. Oh, never mind. You left your fingers already. Put them back in the bag. I don't want them no more. Oh, wait a minute. Let's see. Top off. You already know how you do it. Top it off. Take it. Wait, it's not. No, it's not. Nice. Yeah. Let's get it. All right, here we go, y'all. It's getting juicy. Let's see what the hell Emily's talking about because we're still not sure what she's talking about. Dang. Still got to do more. Oh, wait. Yo, it's that cable car guy. He's on top of the roof with Emily. I don't know if you're not seeing him. He's right there with her. I don't know who he is. I don't know if I did all the dirty work for him, and he just came to, uh, just came to take Emily, but we about to see him. You're so focused on Emily. You don't even pay attention to me. That must be, that gotta be me, right? They're like, they look like me. Come on, get out of here. Uh, Let's grab this, though. We got a bookie book. It's another strange this book. This one's called Arcade. I just want to go home. Let's see, let's see where you at. What is all this? How'd I end up here? Yesterday my life was all crappy as always, but at least there weren't monsters running around town. They're trying to eat me alive. Now I'm trapped in this hellish, bizarre nightmare. There's ash everywhere and the moon is gone. Yesterday there was a full moon and now there's no trace of it. But when did it happen? Was I sent forward in time? Am I a diff am I in a different reality? Did everyone turn into a monster? Am I in a coma and all this is a dream? What? What is all this? I can't remember anything. I want to get out, uh, but how am I supposed to reverse all this if I can't tell what triggered this madness in the first place? I don't know what to assure. I assume. I know that there's no way out, that's for sure. The cars are not working, phones are dead, and I can't leave by foot. No matter how much I run, when I turn back, I'm never more than a mile away from the town. I think I'm in a cage. That's it. This is a freaking cage. Something has trapped me here to amuse itself with my pain. It wants me to suffer, and it will stop until I'm dead. Or worse. Uh, I can still try the cable car. I have a fragment of a ticket in my pocket. I don't remember where I got it. If someone left it there for me, maybe it's a hint. If I manage to reach the cable car without being caught by those monsters, maybe I'll be able to break free. Maybe I'll still have a chance. I don't know who the diaries belong to, but we can set this person free. It's like it's waiting for something. Oh, man. We didn't get any... Uh... Oh, man. We didn't get no... Um... Like jewel or anything to bring him back to life. Was it one inside the school? I kind of want to go back and look because I like to do everything and I don't want to get to the end of the game and they sound messed up because I didn't find it. But this is what you wanted. Not her. She was mean to me like the others. But I. I. <sighs> Emily, I found you. Are you okay? Oh, you're not hurt, are you? Leave me. W why are you saying this? You left me. I was new at school. Everyone was picking on me. And you. You're my cousin. And you turned your back on me. That's not true. You're worse than them! You made me think we were friends! Well, let's go home! And we can... Home? Look around, Sally! Does it look like home to you? We're trapped here! There's nothing we can do! It won't let us! It just won't! We're supposed to help her. What? Why me? I've tried. I've tried so hard. No one's trying to help me. It will be okay. Perhaps we can still do something. I know where they'll take her. Down to the mine, so we can't reach her. I can't go there. 
but I can help you get in. There's still a chance for you to make things right, Sally. And then what? He's right. The town is doomed. We're doomed. Come, Sally. We need to see something. What? What is it? What happened? Come, Sally. This oh, is wait. important. Let me see what's in here. I'm not gonna find. And nothing can compare it. What is that? Is that Bethelwood? But if that's then where am I? What is this place? Emily was right. This isn't your home. It's somewhere else entirely. But there's still hope. The cable car will take you away from this place for good. But you need to find your cousin first. I don't understand. How do you know all this? Do you know Emily? What exactly are you? I'm a friend. I've been helping Emily way before you arrived. And now I need your help to bring her back home. Is it a grandpa or something? You yeah, have to not. rescue Emily from the mine. I'll take care of the rest. Okay. I'll, I'll do it. Meet me at the school entrance. Take your time and be prepared. You won't be able to come back from the mine until you find Emily. Is that clear? Yes. Good. I'll be waiting. Thank you, Sir Proxy Stranger. Meet the mysterious man. Uh, this is not Bell the Wood. I don't know what's going on, but that man said there's a way to get out of here, leave this nightmare behind. I have to get ready and meet him at the school entrance. This is my last chance to save Emily and save myself. Excuse me. Well, I'm going to right here, guys. If you enjoyed my content, be sure you like, comment, and <laughs> unsubscribe button. Be part of Murder Crows today. Again, no one touched today. I love you. So we're getting closer, but as I expected, she's mad at uh, Sally because Sally did nothing to help her and I was supposed to be my cousin and I just let him do it. So, I mean, I wasn't wrong, but at the same time, I felt like she was going through all of this just to see how Sally felt because she did start crying and said, no one's around trying to help me. Like, you want me to do all this, but no one's helping me. So I think this is like a trial so, for that, so, so that Sally can feel how Emily felt when she was getting bullied in uh, school and all that. Again, nothing has changed. It's still the same old thing, but a different day. Get up.